Howdy, lieutenants and economists. The most volatile, evil, disgusting things on the planet, humans. If you have a video request, you can always go to assholeconsulting.com. Yeah, I am gonna charge you, kids. And that is the importance of not fucking up. You are such an asshole! Getting shit done, Cappy. <clears throat> it is Saturday, and the Capmeister has a couple minutes before the GF is ready. So we do not waste any time <clears throat> here at Asshole Consulting. Cappy, can you do a clarity test on Mia Khalifa? We certainly can, because you paid me. Let's look her up. Mia Khalifa. Who's Mia Khalifa? Mia Khalifa. Holy boobs. What? Did I see that? Hang on now. Wow. Nice cans. Okay. Alrighty. Well, <clears throat> Mia Khalifa, also known as Mia Kalista, is a Lebanese-born American social media personality, sports cam commentator, sports commentator, okay, and webcam model, best known for formerly performing as a pornographic actress of 2014 to 2015. Okay. So that's why she's got the big cans. Born in Beirut, Khalifa moved to the United States in 2001. She began acting in pornography in October of 2014 and by December was ranked the number one performer on the website Pornhub. Her career choice was met with controversy in the Middle East, especially for a video in which she performed sexual acts while wearing the Islamic hijab. I won't stir up no controversy. <laughs> but aren't a lot of Lebanese... Um, Aren't there a lot of them Christians though too? They're not. They're not the uh, Lebanon is not the uh, bastion of terrorism that one might think. After three months, Khalifa left the pornographic industry to pursue other interests. All right. Uh, early life. Mia Khalifa was born on February tenth, nineteen ninety three, in Beirut, Lebanon. Moved with her family to the United States, two thousand one, leaving her home in the wake of the South Lebanon conflict. Her family is Catholic, okay, and she was raised in that religion in which she described as a very conservative home, although she is no longer practicing, you think? Khalifa attended a French private school in Beirut, okay, so she came for money, where she learned to speak English after moving to America. She lived in Montgomery County, Maryland, and played lacrosse in high school. Khalifa has talked about being bullied in high school for being the darkest and weirdest girl there. I don't believe that, which intensified after the September 11th attacks. I don't, I'm sorry, I don't believe it. Um, she attended the Masson Newton Military Academy, moved to Texas to attend college. She got bachelor's of art degree in history. Okay, worthless degree there. Came for money, worthless degree. While, Khalifa, uh, while at college, Khalifa worked at a bartender, did some modeling work. She was also a briefcase girl on the local Spanish TV game show, Deal or No Deal. Moved to Miami, approached for doing nude modeling. She accepted, entered a pornographic industry of 2014, so she was 21. She was walking in Miami, and she was asked if she'd consider appearing in pornographic films, being brothers, doing, wearing a hijab and a threesome. That scene brought Khalifa instant popularity as well as criticism from writers and religious figures. Since producer, we weren't trying to exploit 1.5 million views. She'll show you big tits. I'll show you how to retire early. Who makes more money? <laughs> Thus, Operation Evil. She received death threats, state of Iraq, ba ba boo, beady bee, boo doo boo. Uh, post pornographic career. Because uh, she left. 2017, so she was 24 when she left. <laughs> because web modeling is not... <laughs> it's not pornographic, but it's still kind of web whoring. Uh, after leaving porn, worked in Miami as a paralegal and a bookkeeper. Okay, real job. She transitioned into a career as social media personality, webcam model, and sports commentator. Runs a YouTube channel and Twitch. Performed as webcam model, social photo shoots, merchandise, and access content at Patreon. Explicit photo shoots, blah, blah, blah. She and Gilbert Arenas, host of Out of Bounds Daily Sports Show. Sports ball, dial da 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 ba <coughs> blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Online petition has called for Khalifa to be appointed by President Donald Trump as the next United States ambassador in Saudi Arabia. Uh, imagine this. She married a high school sweetheart in 2011, so she was... 
18, maybe 17. They separated in 2014, divorced in 2016. Who knew? This and that, that and this. Okay. Uh, came from wealth. No real degree. Uh, fake, uh, worthless degree. Does she have real world working experience? Yes, she does. Because not only is bookkeeping, bartending, and a paralegal real work experience, I would also argue that, you know, working in porn, much as you might disagree with it, or modeling, that takes work. That's that's a real job. She's never collected a government check. Maybe she has, but <clears throat> it <clears throat> would have been very minor. Um, and what's she doing now? She's still working. She's doing, you know, the social medias thing, which does take work. Not as much work as other jobs, I'll admit to that, but it does take some work. Uh, so she gets two points there. Would I like to have a beer with her? No, I really wouldn't. Um... You know, we're not talking her, her YouTube videos are as uh, deep and philosophical as Jordan Peterson. Uh, should she run for office? Um, I'd say no. Um, again, anybody's better than professional politicians, so she'd be better than a lot of the current ones out there. But I don't think with her degree in history coming from wealth, that's really what the, the porn doesn't debunk her in my mind. Uh, what the bunks it is or worthless degree, getting by on her looks, um, and having rich parents. That's really why I don't think she should uh, run for office. So there you go. Questions, answers, assholeconsulting.com. Check out all the awesome links down below to shit that will do more than just give you a boner. I, I, I can't give you that, but I can give you early retirement. Uh, I can't give you happiness. I can give you contentment. Nobody can be happy. I can give you ease of life. And I could give you a hell of a lot of cool places to go ride your motorcycle around. Those are all links to the books and everything down below. We'll see you guys later. Toodles.